Big Savage in the building, the grind don't stop unless it kill me. Y'all already know. Welcome to the Savage Nation. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't. Today, we're going to be talking about the Warzone mid-season update and the Vanguard mid-season update. And what really did they change? Y'all already know. Let's get it in. So the moment we all have been waiting for is finally here. The Call of Duty devs got their lazy ass off vacation and they finally got back in the office and pushed out an update trying to get the people what they wanted and what they desperately deserve. The entire COD community, no matter what console or if you own PC, has been putting up with a lot of bullshit from this game. So this was their big chance to really strike back and get the wheel turning to flip this thing around. And do you think they took that opportunity? No, they did not. This mid-season update is another fucking shit stain down the toilet. I honestly don't know what they thinking, but they thinking wrong. Warzone is now completely shit. I mean, when you look at the playlist, we got three rebirth options, which don't even make sense. This just shows you how much they fucked up on Vanguard. Warzone literally just had this integration. They gave us this new style of play with this new map. And they already downscaled back to the old shit. They took out the new resurgence. They took out the Vanguard Battle Royale guns only. And gave us the old shit back. They're literally going down the drain. They tried to do this new shit and, and fully transition people over with Warzone. But they know they can't do that now. People holding on to Modern Warfare for their dead life. And that's where Call of Duty really making their money from. I can pretty much tell you. If it wasn't for these bundles and all this extra money they getting out the ass, Call of Duty and Activision would be our bitches. They would be doing every fucking thing we said and complained about because they know it could be detrimental to them. But with these bundles and shit floating, they getting fucking $200 million bonuses. They not going to ever need to listen to us. So getting right into what exactly changed, quote unquote, on the war zone side of things. They added the well gun. They fucked up the playlist. And they did a bunch of useless fucking weapon balancing changes. I can't get cheeky with this shit. And real talk, most of them don't even make fucking sense, bro. Some of the guns was guns that they already nerfed. Like the auto maiden. You nerfed the gun and then you just buffed it back exactly how the fuck it was. Make it make sense. They slowed down the aim down sight speed for every Vanguard gun. How the fuck does that help? How, bruh? It's like the, it's something not fucking clicking with them. And besides that, they changed a bunch of fucking attachments. You know, it, it, it made a bunch of the ARs on Vanguard better. You know, a lot of less recoil and all that. But goddamn, bruh, that's still not what the fuck we wanted or even needed. This shit could be so simple and done in one update, but they dragging this shit out like a motherfucker. The whole community just want the time to kill to be changed and balance more with these plates and this armor and shit, and that would just fix everything. You feel me? You don't have to fucking nerf and then buff the guns again. Y'all fucking up. Y'all going backwards. They making it harder on themselves. They need to be fucking slapped. With the backhand. The shit is just, man, for a billion dollar company, and it says a lot about them. I don't know. They must not care about how their integrity look. <laughs> but moving on to Vanguard. Oh, my God. This update was even fucking worse over there. They literally lied on the whole list. Soon as it dropped. Oh, we fixed the STG camo. I log on. Try to grab my gun. This shit still broke! I can't get cheeky with this shit! Like, what the fuck, bruh? I've been that unlucky person. I haven't been able to grind my STG since the game dropped. Little by little, they fixed everybody's shit. And soon as they make the mid-season update, 
saying that they was going to address it. It's in the fucking patch notes and all. Patch notes and all. I hop on to finally get it done, do my last little challenge, and the fucking list was capped. They lied, bro. And this is why I don't fucking trust nobody now. What else they lie about? Packet bursts? The latency fucking bullshit that make you glitch across the map and then kick you out? They lied about the damn weapon balance changes because most of these motherfuckers, including the shotguns, still fucking hitting the same. Hold on, hold on. It's more now. What else did they fucking lie about? The spawns are not fixed. That's big cap. I got hella games in. The shit is exactly the same. You kill, you do good, they spawn you fucking behind and in front of people. You're going to get your ass shot whenever you're on your street. Don't play hardcore. The fucking bombs and grenades still going off. You can't see shit. It's fire everywhere still. Man, this shit's so fucked up. It's already enough to say that they've ruined more than what they fixed. And that's not even it. The tactical pacing, combat pacing, blitz pacing, all that shit is still fucked up too. That don't even work right. The map fucking selection, that's still fucked up too. You barely gonna play the whole list of maps. It's fucking 20, 23 maps on the game, but you only play 10 of them. What the fuck is going on? Call of Duty is literally in the worst state it has ever been. They fucked up a free to play game. That w it, this game was on, it was popular. It was doing better than they multiplayer. How y'all fucking up the breadwinner? God damn, at least act like you care, god damn it. Act like you got some sense, god damn it. Act like you know how to make a game, god damn it. I don't know how much more I can take. I don't know what y'all gonna do. It's a bunch of people that already moved on, you feel me? We the last few stragglers hanging on, but they only got a little bit more time with me. About a season or two, maybe even three, if I can. But they keep fucking this shit up. I'm out, bruh. I am out the door with no hesitation. Just like I did Modern Warfare. And, you know, even though I think that that was a more shittier game by design, including, like, the maps and all that other bullshit that made people just camp forever. Cough, cough. The fucking loud-ass footsteps. This game is so broken and fucked up that it's just unplayable it's literally unplayable i don't even want to play it i get in i be excited by the time i get off i want to cry minecraft is that you calling my name fortnite is that you i'm, I'm fucking leaving bro i'm telling you they better fix this shit but at this rate i have no hope that they will fix it and if they do fix it it's definitely gonna be a little too late a little too late when you fucking up the COD fundamentals, that mean it's time to go. Because this shit, it ain't what it used to be and it never will. Y'all already know. Shout out to the Savage Nation. Appreciate y'all coming through. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace. I hate my shit. I spent the light in. I got the pipe in. Gonna spend a block, no type in. I just want the face like we Skype in. Can't come no hoe, they be trifling.